Hi, you are welcome back to the second part for today, day three. The topic we're going to be looking at is blended learning as technology enabled learning in the classroom. The learning outcome. By the end of this topic, you will be able to apply the SMART model as a guide to select adequate technology for learning outcome or outcomes. Now, what is technology enabled learning? Adding technology to in-person teaching and learning that may enhance engagement and improve learning outcome. Now, the progressive implementation of the new technology uses smart descriptor. Let us look at the descriptor and the indicator. Technology is shifting from what it used to be in the case of adoption to adaptation. Now, SMART came up with four descriptors. The first is substitution, argumentation, modification, and redefinition. When you talk about substitution, what are the indicators that will enable you to know that this technology is substitution and not argumentation? So we're going to take them one after the other. First is the substitution. The indicators shows that use computer technology same way you will use pen and paper, e.g. type and handwritten documents. When you type and you handwrite, you are using the computer as if you are still handwriting. But the only thing is that you gain enhancement on the use of technology. The second descriptor is argumentation. With argumentation, the technology has a new dimension, e.g. computer and pen and paper quiz. The difference comes in the time spent to receive feedback then the feedback will be received with further reinforcement that will aid learning, such as video or test. When this happens, you are argumenting. Then the third descriptor is modification. Used when technology, you use technology to change the function of an activity or section or a lesson. For example, AI software could be used to turn a class note into story performance. When this happens, you are modifying. Then the final one is the red definition. This provides, in this area, provide application or tools that could help complete tasks easily, e.g the use of spell checkers, turn it in, and Grammarly. Now let's see the graphical illustration of SMART model. Here we we'll talk about substitution. Now here teach art as a tool, substitutes no functional change. It's just a tool. It works like a tool. There is no functional change. Then you have the argumentation. In the argumentation, the technology acts as a tool substitute with functional improvement. Yes, it's a tool, but you now have some improvement on it. Then the third is modification. Technology allows for significant task redesign. So there is a little change in this instance. Then the final one is the redefinition, a total change, a total change. The tech allows for creation of new tasks previously inconceivable. You didn't have the task in mind, but this tech has come to redefine it totally. So we have this for substitution, 
augmentation, modification, and redefinition. These are small models guiding the usage of technology in blended learning. In summary, we have looked at the definition of technology enabled learning, and we have presented the four descriptors of SMART model, which are substitution, argumentation, modification, and redefinition. With this, you have this assignment to take. And the assignment says, what type of technology enabled learning are you using in your institution? Describe the technology or the technologies and provide the indicators. Work on this assignment and we shall discuss it when we get to class. Thank you for listening.